There's a section that says, Friendly, I want you to know that our God is greater than our circumstances. And then there's places where you could fill in the line. Hey guys, welcome back. I'm so excited this morning because I just got this from Compassion. So basically, a few weeks ago, I signed up to be a correspondent for Compassion. And so what a correspondent does is they are the ones who will write letters to a sponsored child that is not receiving letters. And so I was doing research about this, and basically what I found is that sometimes um, large companies or large churches will go ahead and sponsor a child through Compassion but they're not able to then send letters. And so Compassion really values both the financial side of it and the letter and praying side of it. Those are both very important to the child. And so when they do have a child that's being financially sponsored, but they're not being written to, they go and seek people who will make that commitment to write to them and just kind of build a relationship with them. So that's what I signed up to do. Um, and that's what this package is. So, when you open the package, it has a letter, and I'll read it. It says, Dear Kiani, thank you so much for volunteering to share words of love and encouragement with Franley. You will build such a special relationship with him as a correspondent. Each letter you write will speak truth and hope into your child's life, assuring him that God cares about him, and so do you. I've enclosed a welcome kit to help you learn more about Franley. You are uniquely assigned to him as a correspondent, so your notes and letters are the only ones he will receive. We are often told by children years later that it was the letters that they received that continues to give them hope. So as you can imagine, you will play a very important role in your child's life. I hope you'll take a minute to introduce yourself to Franley today. He is eager to learn more about you. And then at the bottom, it just has general information about Compassion and the website. And then just as you would with a sponsored child, you also get one of these booklets that's all about your child. As you heard in the letter, his name is Franley. And in the book, it just gives a whole bunch of information about him. It says his name. It gives his birthday, which just passed in January, it gives his country. He's from the Dominican Republic. Um, it talks about his life. And so he lives with his mother and his father. They both work. He helps his family with running errands. Like it just gives different things. It gives his favorite activities. And then it gives information about his school, where it's located, the language that they speak, which is Spanish. Um, it talks about some of the benefits that he receives through the financial part of compassion. It talks about his community and just the country in general. It gives like statistics. Um, and then it just talks about writing a letter, um, some tips for writing letters and things like that. I love that they do these booklets, they're just very personal and they help you to kind of understand your child and the type of life that they live a little bit better. And so last but not least, and this is actually my favorite part of these packages, is the letter template. And so on it, you can just give them like your name, you can tell them where you live. They give this little map piece where you can color in your state, which is really nice. Um, and then it gives you a chance to tell them who's in your family, how old they are, what their names are, some of the things you enjoy doing. Um, and then on the other side, it's like fill in the blank. So God created you to blank. I encourage you to blank. I would like to know more about your blank. And at the bottom, you can put in a personal prayer. So this is really nice. I love these letter templates. And I actually received information about Franly um, last weekend, but I wanted to wait for this template because it's just more personal. And I think it's really nice to have um, an actual handwritten letter. So I will start our relationship off with this. And then it also comes with an envelope that you put this into. 
so that's what I got in the mail. Um, so excited to get started with this relationship with Franly. He is so adorable. Um, I did, for those of you who saw my last compassion video, you know that I already sponsored a little girl named Taya and she's four. So um, I did receive a letter from her a few days ago and um, I believe she wrote the letter around like December and so her letter is kind of tailored around the holidays and what they do in Ethiopia in the holidays. Um, and yeah it's a nice letter she gave me some more prayer requests more things to be praying about for her it's actually funny because when i went and signed up to be a correspondent they were asking me if i had any preferences um whether it be the country they're from the age the gender whatever and <clears throat> since i sponsored taya and she's so young she's only four um i was really thinking that i wanted like an older child like maybe like pre-teenage because you know Taya is too young to write her own letters and so what happens is she tells an older person in her community what she wants to say and they write it down obviously it's still her words but um it's just nice knowing that it's the actual child writing you the letter but anyways I was thinking about it and I'm like you know they can just give me a child who's in need I don't really care what age what gender where they're from whatever and so they sent me friendly I'm actually gonna go ahead and write this letter now and get this stuff started so if you have any questions on how to become a correspondent how to become a sponsor um what my experiences are like please don't hesitate to comment down below ask me your questions let me know your thoughts and yeah thank you so much for watching and i'll see you in my next video